Now that we have our part in our slicer, let's go ahead and go over some best practices for multicolor prints to save you time and filament. First off, anytime I'm doing a multicolor print, I always want to make sure that I've got a purge tower enabled. So I'm going to go into my global settings, go to others, and I want to check prime tower. Purge tower is just another name for it. As soon as I re-slice it, it's going to be adding another block somewhere in our workspace. There we go, right there. And this is going to be where the nozzle is actually purging out all the different material. Now, anytime you are working with a bamboo or any other multicolor print, it is going to be squirting out the one color to replace it with another. But as soon as it's done purging out those materials, there is going to be a certain cavity inside of that nozzle. And the whole purpose of this prime tower or purge tower is that it takes up that cavity. So as soon as it is done printing a little bit of material on this tower, it can then move over to your print and there won't be any void of any plastic. 